Hi, it's Rod Slater, and it's great to have you on board here today, and I'm really excited because we've got uh, Matt here, uh, who's a barbecue expert. We've got Ruben, who is a barbecue butcher expert, to show us exactly, and more importantly, to show me what we do. We're going to go through stages of how to prepare the grill and to put the charcoal in and the cooking process. Next thing is Ruben, our butcher, is going to go through the preparation of the meat. Um, so on the side of beef, so the ways you've got you can go through all of it on the sort of bases on the forequarter of the beef, which is the shin on the bone, which leads onto the, the blade bone, um, the crosscut blade, the boulder roast, the chuck steak, and then you lead them into the inside, which is the meat, which is the closest to the bone from where the scotch fillet comes down, is the short rib, which is beef short ribs. Um, so if you're getting beef short ribs, they are. Uh, in my sort of experience, that's, that's what I enjoy doing on a barbecue because you, you can't fail them. You cook them for about eight to 10 hours and they just absolutely come out, they melt in your mouth, all the sinew and everything just sort of, just releases and just comes into a jelly bean. Um, and then the holy grail is the brisket. Um, to be able to actually pull that off um, is, a, is a massive feat and that's when all your friends and family are just gonna be going, all the oohs and ahs gonna be coming out when you're cooking and eating. Um, shit on the bone, you can use, um, if you ask your butcher to, um, for a whole piece and then again cooking that, that's going to be, the longer you do it the better it is. Nothing is going to happen um, in liquidy split for two hours, unless, and that's why we've chosen the scotch fillet today. Um, for doing the um, scotch fillet, we're going to be able to do that in two hours and that's going to be a nice simple meal that you can do for a special occasion or something like that. 